Did you know that you can enjoy the convenient features of your Android smartphone with available Sync 3 plus Android Auto? Let me explain. When you download Android Auto to your smartphone on Google Play and connect to Sync 3, the system integrates a limited number of apps from your smartphone and displays them on the touchscreen for easy access, including music, messaging, phone calls, and Google Maps, which provides voice-activated navigation, live traffic updates, and more. To use Android Auto, your phone must be compatible with Sync 3 and be running Android 5.0 or higher. Also, you must have the latest version of the Android Auto app and other Google apps downloaded on your phone, including Google, Google Maps, and Google Play Music. Next, you'll need to enable Android Auto in your vehicle. To do so, just press the settings icon on your touchscreen, Android Auto Preferences, and then slide the button to the right to enable. To connect, plug your smartphone into a USB port with this icon using your device's manufacturer provided USB cable. The first time you connect, you'll see a pop-up message on your vehicle's Sync 3 touchscreen asking if you want to connect. Press Continue. When the next pop-up appears, press Agree to accept the terms and conditions. You will also be asked to accept terms and conditions for driver safety on your smartphone. Once you're connected, Android Auto will appear on the touchscreen, giving you access to your phone, text, Google Maps, and other available apps. Keep in mind, when you're connected to Android Auto, many Sync 3 features, such as the optional navigation system and Sync App Link, will not be available. You can, however, access a limited number of Sync 3 features by pressing the tachometer icon in the bottom right corner of the touchscreen, then the Return to Sync tile. This takes you to an integrated view that allows you to use certain Sync 3 and Android Auto features, like audio, phone, and Google Maps. You can also control Sync 3 features using your five-way steering wheel controls. To exit this view and return to Android Auto, press the Android Auto icon in the feature bar at the bottom of the screen. To disable Android Auto, touch the tachometer icon, return to Sync, then Android Auto Preferences on the home screen. Touch Enable, then Disable to disconnect. Any questions? Go to owner.ford.com.